<laughs> I, I'm sorry, I'll be right with you. Uh, okay, I'm not saying it's a bad idea. I'm saying it's overkill. It's a weapon! Kill is the point. Not if it blows the user's arm off! Oh, just, just, just stop talking! <sighs> Where are we? Ah! <clears throat> so, uh... You, you look like someone who's always searching for a new weapon. Am I right? Actually, I... <sighs> but you're just nuts! I am with a customer! I... I'm not a customer. I got it! Triple the powder, it'll blow a strider sky high. Ba-boom! One shot kill, guaranteed. Uh, maybe I am. Then you are in the right place at the right time, Red! How would you like to be the proud owner of the world's first machine-enhanced... Explosive, done-in-one, machine-wrecking... Yet perfectly safe, Javelin Thrower. Are you two from around here? Nah, the claim. Dad sent us out west in search of some unknown opportunity. Said we'll know it when we see it. Sounds like you had other ideas. Let's just say that opening another trading post for my parents isn't how I want to make my mark in this world. <sighs> I imagine traveling alone must be nice. So she's your partner? My apprentice and my sister. She's why we're out here. There was an incident, another incident. Involving explosives? But boom And Dad's precious homebrew. He shipped us out the next day. Huh. Tell me more about this weapon of yours. I saw a scroll when I was a kid by some Karsha scholar who wandered out west. Had a scary drawing of a Tanakh warrior hunting with a kind of javelin thrower. Effective? Yes. Basic? Undoubtedly. But coming out here made me remember it. And I am on the brink of vastly improving the tool's archaic design. Whereas I will perfect it. I can use machine parts to enhance the user's throw, increase the projectile's velocity. Well, Boomer here is adamant that enhancing the projectile is better. Namely with explosive tips. Boomsticks. Why not both? That could work. There's one small snag. I need the parts to make the first working model. Well, for starters, I'll need charger horns. Intact. Yeah, that. Just be sure to shoot them off before the machine goes down. Otherwise, they break. But the real innovation, you keep it to yourself, is a fang horn rib. There's a mean one east of here. Blow it sky high. Boomer! You get them for me. It's yours. My treat. You have a deal. There's a charger herd. I'm gonna have to shoot off the horns for Dell and Boomer. Shock could do a lot of damage.
should have enough charger horns for down the Just need a rib from that fang horn you were talking about. Prepared. Boomer said that Fanghorn should be nearby. There's the Fanghorn. Gonna have to take it down to get its rib. <clears throat> I know that look. You've got all the parts, haven't you? Here you go. Outstanding! I only need a few minutes to finish the prototype. I'll take the version that won't blow my arms off. Thanks. Hi. So did you blow up any machines to get the parts? Or any bandits? You really like explosions, huh? Here we go. With the boomsticks? Oh, you betcha. Um, is it safe? Probably. Can I have one? No! Aww. Oh. Cause we're gonna make you something even better. Ba boom
the there ammo. You are. Do you know how much blaze that would use? No way. About time he would crawl. Hmm. Here you're the rowdy spark we should be thanking for kicking Olvind out of the forge. Petra mentioned you were trouble, and trouble's always welcome at my shop. Take a look. Won't find weapons like these anywhere in the dark. Guaranteed. See you when I see you, Red. Maybe this guy will fix my lucky hammer by then. Maybe it'll stop breaking, too. Damn mine is what happened to me. <clears throat> what mine? Northeast of Chain Scrape, where the river ends. I told Corvin we should stop when the first cave in happened, but <sighs> Olven probably threatened to cut off her pay. Or worse. How about you slow down and take me through it? You mentioned you were injured in a cave-in. Yeah, <clears throat> a couple days ago. That's how I hurt this blasted leg. <laughs> Corvin and the others were opening a new vein while I was checking on an older one. As soon as the blast hit, Tunnel I was in collapsed. Might have dodged it if I wasn't running on barely a spark of sleep. We were pushing too hard and too fast. And you're afraid Corvin and the others might not be as lucky if it happens again. Mm-hmm. Hit the nail right on the head. Who's Corvind? He's our foreman. And a damn good one. The kind that knows how to deal with management when it gets unreasonable. He even blamed himself for my injury when it was Olvin who ordered the extra shifts. Sounds like a good guy. That's why we all put up with the long hours and lousy conditions. I could check in on your crew, if I'm in the area. I... would appreciate that. Thank you. Love my face. Our town is working again, thanks to you.
I'll leave you in the dust. More on us than I'd find his crew. This must be the mine Arnav told me about. It looks like the miners are in trouble. That looks like the foreman Arnav mentioned. I should check in with him. You good? I, I'm okay. Thank you, Corvin. Corvin? Arnav sent me. I'm... Not... Not now. Uh, uh, Easy. Whew. What happened? Explosion in the mine. Water flooded the whole place. Uh, some of my guys are still... They're still down there. I can't, can't stop. You've done enough. Are you hurt? I'm... I'll live. The others. Please. I need to know exactly what happened. We use controlled blasts to open up new veins in the mountain. One of them must have gone wrong. I can't... I have to go. How many are still down there? Corvent, how many? Uh... Two. Two, I think. Two more. I'll do what I can. Miners, quick. Hello? Can anyone hear me? Them doesn't look too good. I think I'm starting to see. Is that a Nora? Are you okay? Who are you? Corvin sent me. Are you hurt? Uh, my leg. I. I was a little too close to the blast. What happened? We were blasting in the farthest tunnel. The scaffolding didn't hold. It collapsed. I... I think it blocked the drainage shaft. Water started flooding the place as quick as I drink ale. I barely managed to drag us here. So something's keeping the water inside the tunnels. What are you thinking? I've got an idea. Are there more explosives? Are you crazy? Yeah. Should still be some up top, but... You'll need these fuses. Are you crazy? You can't move. And I'm not leaving you. It's not like she can make things worse. Don't go anywhere. I need to find whatever's blocking that drainage shaft. I blow it sky high. Oh. 
Made it. There's the debris blocking the shaft. If I can reach those explosives up on that track, maybe I can blast with the blockage. Water's ice cold. Swim past him now this time. I don't know where I did on that one. to those explosives. <laughs> we should follow those tracks. See if they lead to the explosives. Oh, 
two explosives up on the track. Just need to get across somehow. Got its attention. Check on those miners. know that. Better let Corvin know if he's all right. I found the two you mentioned. They're safe, but could probably use a hand. Is that everyone? <sighs> it is. I dread to think what would have happened if you hadn't shown up. I knew we were blasting too much, but the man who staked the claim here, Ulvut, he kept pushing and pushing me. I tried to shield my crew from his constant demands every damn day. I... I should have been stronger. You were there for your crew when they needed you. 
That counts for something. Ulvan can threaten me all he wants. I am not letting my people back into those mines. Well, it's a good thing Ulvan's been kicked out of Chain Scrape, then. Ulvan's gone? We were so busy working in the mines, and then, then, then the explosion, we never heard. Something we can celebrate after I get my crew back to Chain Scrape. Will you be all right? Yes. I can take it from here. You are owed, Huntress. Thank <laughs> you.